What's going on, everybody? Back in the building. I'm doing what I do. You know who I am. You know what I do. So I'm gonna go right on into it. Top of this program is today. You know, I'm gonna talk about Chick Fil A. All the little protests and all this little protests and the shit y'all did for Chick Fil A. It really didn't do anything to them. People were eating more chicken. I ain't gonna lie. I like Chick Fil A. So fuck y'all. But the topic with Chick-fil-A is their policy they had where they made a statement. And if you look at Chick-fil-A's statement, they didn't bash homosexuals or whatever kind of relationship you're in. They said they adhere to a Christian lifestyle, this, that, and the fifth. Homosexual groups, as always, ran with the fucking ball. And now they were bashing, boycott Chick-fil-A. And nah, shut the fuck up. At the end of the day, Chick-fil-A is still making money on their stock. This did not damage Chick Fil A. Here's the here's the problem. What you got? Here's what you got to understand. Chick Fil A is based in Atlanta, I think, and then the deep south and the South General. That's the Bible Belt. You're not gonna hurt them. I can see if Chick Fil A was based like maybe up north, where all these fucking sympathetic motherfuckers would have said, "You can't really say that." But at the end of the day, this is in the Bible Belt, where that's their belief. Hey, they're strong with their beliefs. You got to give them credit for that. But the gay activists were trying to get the company boycotted. They, but they weathered the storm. I give Chick-fil-A credit for holding on. Now, gay activists also were making Chick-fil-A look out to be this big Satan. Have they fired people who are gay? No, they haven't fired with people who are gay. Are they refusing to hire people that are gay? No, they aren't refusing to hire people that are gay. At the end of the day, people might, you know, they might did some damage, but they didn't do what Chick-fil-A came out of look. It's like falling and shit and it's coming out like a rose. That's what Chick-fil-A has done, really. If anything, you gave them good marketing, good press, as they say. You know, they have a very supportive base. Like I said, it's the Deep South. Go look at it. No, it just goes to show you that, you know, all, you know, all you have to do, you know, you don't have to appeal to everybody to make a buck, which Chick-fil-A is doing, man. They ain't, they ain't appealing to everybody. But they making money somehow, so eat more chicken. Deuces. There. That's it. That's him.